When you're karting, there's a lot of variables to manage. There's all your engine, your gear selection, your jetting. And one more variable is your tire pressure and how it affects the tires. So we're going to run two sessions out there. We're going to run them ex exactly back to back. So the track conditions are going to be as close as possible to each other. Two completely different set of tires, same amount of wear, and they're going to be set at completely different pressures. So what we're going to do is we're going to set the tire pressures at one pressure. We're going to go run five laps to go warm them up. We'll find out how much they warmed up. Then we're going to jack the tire pressure to some crazy number that you'll never do in a race. And then we're going to do it again and see exactly how the tires respond to that. We set the first set of tire pressures to 8 PSI. 8 pounds, perfect. Okay. We tried really hard to get good footage for you guys. And it was the windiest day I think I've ever had at the track. Just put your lap counter at five and come in. Because okay. we're just trying to get the tires warmed up and then the temp the time between when you stop and when I get the temperatures is gonna be critical, so. Outside rear. Half inside rear. Perfect. Okay, get out and we'll swap tires. Okay, five laps. We check your tire temps and pressures and we're done. The next set of tires we set at 15 PSI. That's it, we got our data. Let's get you off and we'll get off this track. So Mark, talk to me about the two sessions. Tell me a little bit about your thoughts, your opinions, uh, on, so on the proper pressures and the high pressures. Uh, it's weird, the proper pressures actually in these conditions didn't work quite as well, I think. Um, the 
high ones were probably a bit too high and the low ones were probably a bit too low, but overall the, the harder tires actually felt better in these kind of low grip conditions. For the first set of tires, we set them at 8 PSI. They started the day at about 20 degrees Celsius and they had a change in pressure from 8 pounds all the way up to about, on the hardest working tire, the outside tire, up to 11 PSI. So that was an increase of 3 PSI. And the temperature, this is a surface temperature, went from about 20 degrees Celsius to 64 degrees Celsius. That's a pretty big, remarkable jump. Here's something that's even more interesting though. On the second set of tires, we had a starting pressure of 15 PSI and a starting temperature of around 17 degrees Celsius. And after five laps, the pressure went from 15 to 18 PSI. So again, another three PSI jump in pressure. But the temperatures on the surface of the tire were, get this, 78.3 degrees Celsius. So almost a 14 degrees Celsius increase as compared to eight PSI. This means that when you have more pressure in your tires, you're gonna be generating more heat. Surprisingly, I thought the, the low pressures would work probably a little bit better, but uh, yeah, that's surprising. So you got a better lap time with the high pressures, is that correct? I did, yeah. What were your lap times approximately? Uh, it was actually, well, the difference was about a second. Uh, a second a lap. High 53s versus high 54s. I think, uh, I think it was a good enough indicator that the, the high pressures were working a bit better, actually. All right, thanks for everyone tuning in. Thanks to Alfano for bringing us the gauge that make this possible. I really like this gauge. It's digital, it's accurate. You have air cylinders so you can bump up your pressures on the side of the track. You can upload your pressures to the dash. An excellent gauge, an excellent tool. Play some Alfano stickers. If any of you guys are interested in getting some Alfano stickers, send your address to the email below and I'll mail you some stickers in the mail. <laughs> trying to convert me. <laughs> no, I'm not trying to do nothing. There's two A's. There you go, one for each side. Yeah, we'll see you at the next uh, race. <laughs> I don't know when I'm going to release this. I don't even know if this might come out after the races. We'll see. Yeah, it's Base, it's no big deal. <laughs> You're not doing a duck face? <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, I thought that was going to be funny. Trust me anymore. Not since I made a meme about him with an anime.